Volkswagen has stated that it will discontinue producing the attractive full-size sedan, which is bad news for fans of the car, because it will allow the company to concentrate on selling more cars. The RTN's last model year is 2024. Welcome everyone, in today's video. We're going to look at 2023 Volkswagen RTN Cell R-Line is better than Audi sedan. The performance, interior comfort, and cargo space of the Volkswagen RTN Cell R-Line, as well as its warranty and maintenance coverage, will all be covered in this video. We'll also go over the engine, transmission, and warranty specification. But before we proceed the further video, if you're new to this channel, remember, go ahead and to hit the bell icon to subscribe so you won't miss the informative videos we will upload in the future. 2023 Volkswagen Arteon Cell Our line is better than Audi sedan. The Volkswagen Arteon full-size car is evidence that perfection alone is not sufficient to achieve and maintain success. The Arteon is supposed to be just appealing enough, both on paper and in person, to stand out from a sea of dull vehicles and crossovers without wearing anything that is overly immature. This goal was accomplished by designing the Arteon to have a design that is just right. Inside, there is enough space for you to stretch out your legs, and if the top of your right foot is bothering you, the vehicle's 300-horsepower turbocharged four-cylinder engine and seven-speed dual-clutch automatic transmission are like a quick-acting dab of hydrocortisone. Even with all of the wonderful features that come standard on the Arteon, there just isn't enough there to entice consumers who are considering purchasing a crossover or SUV. The price of the Arteon is one contributing factor. It seems that consumers have chosen that, given the choice, they would rather spend their money on an SUV vehicle of this size. Due to this unfortunate turn of events, Volkswagen has decided that the Arteon will no longer be produced after the model year 2024. They gave the reason that they want to focus on producing automobiles that customers purchase more frequently. Alternatives such as the Teos UV and the ID. 7 EV carry the torch forward while the Arteon heads off into the twilight of its career, pricing, and which one to buy. In spite of the fact that the CR line now also comes standard with adaptive cruise control, automatic high beams, and lane keeping assist, we believe that the Cell R line finds the best balance possible between its stylish appearance and its extensive list of standard amenities. In comparison to the model that serves as the entry-level option, this one has a more upscale interior that comes equipped with a panoramic sunroof, cool ambient lighting, and genuine leather upholstery. Engine, transmission, and performance. The Arteon is powered by a turbocharged, 2.0 lighter, four-cylinder engine that generates 300 horsepower and 295 pound-feet of torque. This engine is paired with a seven-speed dual-clutch automated transmission. The C model comes basic with only front-wheel drive, but the Cell and Cell Premium come with all-wheel drive as standard equipment. Wheels of 18, 19, or 20 inches in diameter are included as standard equipment on all Arteon models, depending on the trim level. Standard adaptive suspension dampers can be manually adjusted to one of three modes, comfort, normal, or sport, or can change themselves automatically to match the way you drive. The ride is always calm and under control, no matter what the conditions are. Although it has decent handling and precise steering that are reminiscent of the 10 best winning Golf GT, you won't mistake this large Volkswagen for a sports sedan because of its size. At the testing facility, the Arteon accelerated from 0 to 60 miles per hour in only 4.6 seconds and completed the quarter mile in just 13.3 seconds while traveling 103 miles per hour fuel economy, and real-world MPG. The EPA has predicted that front-wheel drive RTN vehicles will achieve 25 MPG in the city and 33 MPG on the motorway, while all-wheel drive variants are expected to achieve 22 MPG in the city and 31 MPG on the interstate. As soon as we are able to examine one on our highway fuel economy route at 75 MP, which is a component of our rigorous testing regimen, we will be able to determine its MPG in real-world driving conditions. Interior, comfort, and cargo. Even though the interior of the Arteon is decorated with traditional-looking furniture, the materials that were used were of high quality. Despite this, Volkswagen was able to chisel out a generous amount of internal space from the rakish design of the large five-door. 
it is possible for two tall people with large frames to ride up front without ever colliding elbows. When compared to the previous generation of the VW Passat sedan, which has since been retired, the rear seating is just as accommodating. And there is a discernible improvement in Legroom. The hatchback of the Artean opens up to reveal a capacious cargo area that measures 27 cubic feet. We were able to store nine carry-on baggage behind the rear seat and another 12 with the back seat folded down, making it nearly as useful as an SUV in our opinion. Each Arteon comes standard with a motorized liftgate and front seats that are heated. If you go all the way and get the top-of-the-line cell premium model, you'll get front seats with ventilation, a massage function for the driver, heated seats for the back passengers, ambient lighting with 30 different color options, and black carbon interior trim, infotainment and connectivity. An 8.0-inch touchscreen infotainment system is standard on every Arteon. It's primarily controlled using touch inputs rather than a volume knob, and the steering wheel itself has touch-sensitive controls in addition to being heated. The Volkswagen is equipped with wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto in addition to having two USB ports. When you upgrade to the cell trim level, you get navigation integrated right in, and the cell premium adds a robust Harman Kardon sound system to the mix. A subscription to Volkswagen Carnet grants access to a plethora of additional connected functions, some of which include remote vehicle unlocking and support in times of need, safety and driver assistance features. The Artian comes equipped as standard with a broad variety of driver assistance technology, such as a system that can recognize road signs, adaptive cruise control, automatic high beam headlamps, automated emergency braking, lane keeping assist, and parking sensors in the front and the back. National Highway Traffic Safety Administration and the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety for additional details regarding the outcomes of the crash tests performed on the Arteon. Among the most important safeguards are, one, blind spot monitoring and rear cross traffic alert are both standard features. Two, lane keeping assist and lane departure warning systems are both available. Three, available adaptive cruise control, warranty and maintenance coverage. Volkswagen offers an above average limited warranty as well as complimentary scheduled maintenance for the first two years of ownership. However, the majority of competitors have a longer warranty on the powertrain. The limited warranty covers either four years or 50,000 miles, whichever comes first. The powertrain is covered under warranty for a period of four years or 50,000 miles. Maintenance is provided at no cost for the first two years or 20,000 miles, whichever comes first. That's all for today's video. If you're interested in purchasing Volkswagen Arteon Cell R-Line, kindly let me know in the comments. Don't forget to like the video and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any new videos from our channel. Thanks for watching and see you all soon.